Hello, all of you vaingloriously wonderful people. Rockstar has updated the Newswire, so it's time for another GTA Online news video. The news today is all about the trailer that Rockstar dropped for the upcoming Gun Running DLC. With a confirmed release date of June 13th, we are less than one week away from this explosive new DLC. The trailer offers a quick glimpse into what's coming for this DLC, but keeping with typical Rockstar style doesn't really give much in the way of confirmed details. I'll be stopping the footage for some stills several times in this video to highlight things that I found interesting. You guys all know that I don't do speculation, so you're free to interpret these stills any way you'd like. We've got a closer look at many of the new vehicles in action, plus some shots of the different areas within the bunker, the shooting range that's inside of that bunker, the mobile operations center, plus a lot of the new weapons and clothing. I think I even spotted a few new tattoos, but I'm not entirely certain. I'm fairly certain that we even saw one new vehicle in the trailer that hasn't been featured in any of the screenshots that Rockstar has released before today. It's that armored Humvee looking truck. I didn't notice any weapons on it, but then again I could have overlooked them, but we do see it towing the anti-air trailer in a few screenshots. We can also see that the rocket powered flying bikes do have weapons. Interestingly enough, I didn't notice any other vehicles, which would be odd considering every DLC today has given us at least a few regular vehicles to play with. I'm sure that there will be something hidden away in the DLC files that Rockstar unlocks through their obnoxious, slow release, drip feed style for weeks following the DLC launch. And that's really all there is to the trailer. But before I wrap up, I want to let you know what you can expect from my channel to cover the gun running DLC. I'll be up bright and early on the 13th with a live stream starting at 4 a.m. Central Time as we wait for the DLC to drop. Once it's downloaded and installed on my PC, I'll jump into the game and give you a quick peek at everything that's new and how much it costs. That live stream will last for about an hour after I first go online in the game. Once the live stream is finished, I'll get to work recording and uploading videos for each new vehicle. You can expect to see those on Tuesday morning. On Tuesday afternoon, if everything goes according to plan, I'll begin showing you the new modifications for weapons. On Wednesday, I'll highlight all the new clothing and other personal accessories and any other new gameplay features. And then on Thursday, if there are indeed vehicles hidden away in the DLC that aren't available on the 13th, I'll put them all together in one hidden vehicles video.